Hello, hello, hello. Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. I am your host, Gaming Odyssey. And I'm here to bring to you guys another chapter of the Beginner's Guide. Um, I've been reading a couple of um, statements on the developer's uh, channel. I just want to just help uh, those who are new to the game so that they can understand uh, some of the concepts here and allow better transition into the game. Um, truth of the matter is this. Let's just say, for instance, you're walking on this map. This is most of the time you're, you're walking on this map and uh, you happen to see your people tired. Okay? You're going to see the exhaustion here. It's going to be blue in color. Uh, what you can do immediately, you just press R. Okay? If you press R, you're going to see this come up again. You could press R or you could press this and it will immediately come up. Now, what do you choose? Now, each person has a skill, okay? And this skill is tied into certain things. For instance, now, Ikundayo has, um, I think, Law of Nature, okay? Because his nature, um, Law of Nature is high, he's going to be the first thing that's going to be occupying the hunting part to give us the best uh, time to get food. That means we're going to have a short amount of time to get food if we use the rest. Now, Stealth, who has the best stealth? My character, who is a druid, has the best stealth. So as a result of that, we put him in the stealth area so he can come off fly to camp so that nobody sees us. Um, the, third the third area is, you can see there are two people here. If I left only one person here, it would be five. There is no way I'm going to roll a good enough die to get 22. It's very hard to get that. So what do I do? I carry somebody here and then put them here. Knowledge of world, if you look at under here, again character has a high enough uh, uh, investment in the knowledge of world section in the in, in the person's um, listen, uh, skill area is going to best occupy this, okay? And then anybody who you have left over, you can put them here. And then uh, this one depends on uh, just perception. So many of the times I like to build my characters with very good perception. So yeah, so many of the time anybody can fill this role. But for this cooking part, it takes a great deal of people to you know, fill the role. Let's see, what would she add to, to, to this? If I click on her, look at, you can see that number. She's going to only add a plus two. If I add this, only a plus two. If I do this, only a plus two towards the knowledge section. If I do this, only a plus two. So they don't have good enough uh, world. The person who has a world for me is uh, Lindsay. So I'm going to go over the concept again for you guys. Okay? Very simple. Law of nature, stealth, knowledge of world, and, and then perception. Okay? These are the only thing that has to do with your resting mechanic. Now, let's go over here. These are the um, these are the many uh, uh, how many hours you want to rest, okay? You can just click here and pull and you can determine how many hours you, you can rest. Okay, it's up to you. You can even um do it in this manner whereby you just add the hours as you fit uh, as you see fit. Just keep adding the hours or days that you want to rest through and you can do so. Or you could even do it this way too. You know, you can do it this way. So, many of the times, don't bother with all of those things. Um, the main idea here is for you to be able to uh, rest your party. Now, let's look over this part here again, okay? There's some areas in a dungeon whereby you don't have, um, they don't give you an opportunity to hunt, okay? When they say you can't hunt here, all you need to do is hover over to here where they say total um, rations, and click on it. Use rations. You see this part? It says you use ration. When you use ration, now you can fully heal yourself. Okay? So that is how it's done. Again, all you need to do is just press R. Go ahead to management. Put everybody who, who you want to put in, into all the places. As you can see, it's set only for 12 hours. And if you and if you put your if you put your distance over here, if you put your um um, mouse over here, it says spells will be recovered after t almost 12 hours of rest. Alright, so that's how you do it. Um, what again, what again, what again? 
I think that's about it. And then you rest. Just make sure that all your characters have their spells. Okay, the spell books are properly equipped before you do that. Make sure everything is complete. If there's anything you wish to change, change it now before you go in. Okay. Uh, this is the sister, so I don't need to change anything. Put um, for oven bean. So this one too, I go over it. Anything I want to change here, I change. Yeah, that's it. All right. So that's gonna be it. That's that's just the resting mechanic in the game. All right. I hope I've been helpful. Um, if you have any questions, just leave it in the comment below. Again, I'm your host, Gimme Odyssey. Signing out. Peace.